Hello, I thought I would talk to you a little about the Migraine Tree, one of my earlier works which is now resplendent in its new hardwood frame. This painting was important in my development and has many new innovations and ideas in it. It was my first work to include my symphonic painting ideas, which were originally inspired by uh, fractal graphics in computers, but later inspired by musical forms, the way a single theme can repeat throughout a work in different guises and different transformations, thus making a very complex idea simple on another level too. And this particular painting is about a migraine, about the disturbing headaches and visual illusions that migraine sufferers can have. I had a migraine myself once many years before painting this in my teenage years and um, my vision was distorted as though the jigsaw pieces of my mind of what I could see would, were rearranged in a random way. It was a very frightening experience and the thought that this may continue was also disturbing. So there, there are elements of fear in this and elements of pain as well, something unexpected happening. We have a, a rough tree made of wrangled, crackled bark with a face hanging from it as though the face is made from a piece of metal or flesh dangling from it. Um, from the top of the face we have tentacles of black and white. Migraine sufferers often see black and white patterns or unusual shapes. These reach towards a storm in the sky, a storm of pain with a lightning bolt shooting down through a figure who's almost falling. You'll notice the eye shape here is repeated in various guises in the painting. We have the eye formed into the very wood of the tree itself. The eyelashes becoming prongs. We have an eye in the sky with the head of the falling figure becoming the pupil. And in the distance we have a sunset but the sunset is also an eye. Perhaps this sun on the horizon represents something peaceful, something calm. I think this is the future, something to look forward to, but it's an uncertain future. The simple dot in the, in the sun makes it an eye. It makes it something that's questioning. It makes it something uncertain. It adds an element of insecurity. Whereas if it was merely a white sun, it wouldn't convey anything, anything near the same emotion.